Hello there, Medicine here, and this is another episode of BJD and a cup of tea. Today's tea is a blend of chocolate chip black tea and green black tea from AdagioTeas.com. Um, it's very good in my topsy-turvy Wonderland mug. Today's video is all about photos, doll photography, and face hubs. So I had a request a long time ago, I don't know how long ago, forever, um, for a video that features my doll photography, because I actually do a lot of doll photography um, with these dolls. It's one of the many things I love about this hobby, is doing photos. Um, the second thing I love about the hobby is customizing the dolls. Well, probably first and second, whatever. I love those two things are the most important things I love. Customizing the dolls the way I want and taking photos of said dolls. So, that being said, this is a video featuring my doll photography and showing the face-ups I've done versus the face-ups that the companies have done because I have a pretty good mix of face-ups and blushings I've done and face-ups of companies because after having a child, I no longer had the time to do face-ups like I used to. So a lot of my newer dolls are all company blushings, plus some special dolls that I got, um, uh, like in my last video, the demon, the demon cat and the other doll that was just happened to be fully blushed um, surprise dolls that I got. So that being said, let's launch right into this. So. The first face-up I ever, ever did was Little Momo here. So Little Momo here was my very first face-up. This is actually the face-up on her right now is the second face-up that I ever did. Um, the first face-up I did on Momo was not very good, as you can see. It's not terrible, it's a pretty good start, um, you know, especially working on such a tiny, tiny surface. Um, the second face-up I did is what she currently still has, and this is like probably about seven years old, this face-up and body blushing. I did her whole body, although the body blushing has since faded over time, which tends to happen with body blushings because you move the dolls a lot more, like the bodies, um, get moved for poses and positions and stuff, so sometimes the blushing on the body gets more wear and tear than, say, the face, which you don't really do anything with unless you're constantly adjusting doll eyes or something. Um, but yeah, so that was my very first face up. So that's the preamble, so let's get started. Um, so let's go right into the photos. Here's the photos of the dolls that are my face-ups that I have done and body blushings that I have done. Enjoy!
And now here's a set of face-ups from companies and body blushings from companies. Enjoy! Now these are some of my favorite photos that I have done over the years of all my dolls. So just enjoy the rest of this collection of photos and the music and thank you so much for watching. I hope that the people who requested these videos enjoy it and if you didn't request it I hope you enjoy seeing some of the photography that I've, I've done over the years. Um, maybe you can see how my camera has improved and my photography skills maybe have improved. Maybe. Let's hope. It'd be nice if they did. Um, but I know that some of that's subjective. So please enjoy these photos, and thank you so much for watching. Look forward to more videos in the future. Until next time, bye!